Can you play a Jawworm? You can't in Downfall. I'm not going to take Boss Wop on Silent. I don't enjoy it. Take a Rare Relic or 100 Gold. I like going to early shops. Take the money. Start out with a reasonably safe Silent Start. Bimrin with the Prime Sub in 35 months. Bank for Clumsy. And Osmium, thanks for the Prime Sub. Of all of my subscribers, you are the densest. Thank you. Oh, heck. What happened here? Is Silent the hardest character? I think Silent is probably probably debatable whether she or the defect is harder. Got an early predator. Seems fine. Yes, you can you can scroll back in the the videos. Uh, I think this is the page you're looking for. Videos page. Uh, from there you can go to past make sure you have past broadcast selected and you should see the current broadcast up to maybe 90 seconds ago has been updated live and you can review and rewind anything that's happened recently. But yes, you you can sort of live rewind the current broadcast for yourself. Thanks to the power of Twitch. One of the many features about this website that I really enjoy. Uh, all of our past broadcasts are available for a full 60 days. So anything that I broadcast in the last 60 days on Twitch, you can find on the videos page to watch. It's pretty cool. And then anything older than that, we do of course have the Bela Lord Archives, the Archives YouTube channel as a permanent upload of all the stream videos starting about 24 hours after they go live. So there's a pretty good overlap between the archives and the Twitch VODs, meaning that all of our content is available in perpetuity. Wait, did I type YouTube? Oh, uh, no, 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 the first one was uh, Twitch. Somebody else did the archives command though. Uh, do I want a Bouncing Flask or a Gamble? I'm feeling Gamble here. Let's try it out. I want to, to Eviscerate on this run. Do I know where they've said that, Lazy Dino? I don't know where the devs said that they balanced around Ascension 4 or 5. The places I would go looking for that are things like um, interviews that Megacrit has done on YouTube. So if you YouTube search Megacrit interview, you'll probably get something close to what you're looking for. I don't know where it would have been said otherwise. Poison pot. Oh, I should have taken the bouncing flask. Screw it. I'll take the catalyst anyway. Dang it. Ooh, banana. Wait, this is headed though. I'll take a donut. It's got a feeling. This is known. Thank you, Bailey, for the FAQ help today. Have you given up on taking curses to transform them? Not entirely. Um, 
not every character is in a position to be able to do that, unfortunately. So, ow. Troubling. Oh, here we go. All is well. And we get rewarded with a prismatic shard. After I took poison cards. So it is. So it is. Good luck to us. That'll get rid of uh, Artifact on Sentries. Could keep me alive here. Perfect. Tiny chest is here. Burst is here. Burst catalyst. Let's go. Thanks, prismatic shard. Early on in the challenge, did I have an expectation for which card would be last to master? I think if I had to list top five, I would have put clumsy amongst them. Probably my number one guess would have been Necronomicus, but that worked out. Deadly Poison into Burst Catalyst is super duper lethal. So we just go Neutralize here. Predator here. Survivor. Oh, we didn't draw the Deadly. Hmm. That's really, really bad. I guess. So it dies next turn, or I can prevent three dazed. Let's do that. Hmm. Concerning. Might just be dead here, actually, with this draw order. A shame, but... Tis how it goes sometimes. Ooh. Or perhaps not. First catalyst, finally. Didn't even have to use our potion. Good. Okay, that wasn't horrible. Not in love with bottled flame here, but what can you do? I am in love with crescendo. Burst crescendo. Hmm. Oh, if we find mantra cards, those are really good with burst. Interesting. I guess Beam Cell is more broadly useful. I like that this is Retain, though. Retain Wrath means um, either A, it's Calculated Gamble Fuel, or B, we get to hold on to it until we're ready to kill something. Wrath does not work with Poison. I'm going to try it. And we're going to bottle the Predator. Really good with uh, Bag of Marbles. And there's a Merchant here. Oh, ho, ho, hello. Probably actually want to buy the Well-Aid Plans, huh? 
Move with the second catalyst. Probably. <laughs> We're gonna get Pyramid. Surely. I have no fear whatsoever here. Oh, look at that! How much poison do you want, turn one? Answer is yes. Yes, poison. Plus five is 13. Okay, we get to keep the potion, too. Uh, actually, we also transform this turn. Yes, we do. Even better. Bye-bye. GG. Oh, Seek? Oh my god. Seek for Burst Catalyst. Heck yes. Did you know that I play games other than Slay the Spire? It's true. Catch me over on Baylor Lord Plays for card games, RPGs, strategy games, and more. There's also Feed, but what is Feed compared to Seek Burst Catalyst? Give me that. Feed with Retain Wrath is kind of cool, also. Astrolabe, transform and upgrade three. Or we could take more energy. I say we transform and upgrade three. It's only going to be silent cards that we get. Even if we transform a Watcher card, it turns into a silent card. Fun fact. Oh, there you go. Adrenaline's what I wanted. Poison Stab's also half decent here. Unload does... Better damage than you'd expect. But overall, this looks like something hella broken. Let's keep this run going, because it's stupid. The best kind of stupid. Fun stupid. Yes, uh, Nitrous, if you Astrolabe another color card, you will still get a silent card. Uh, the exceptions to this are, if you transform a colorless card, you'll get a random colorless card. And if you transform a curse, you get a random curse. I don't think I want to fight the Burning Elite this act. Although I bet we could. Slavers could be tough. <laughs> and a blip. And a burst. Oh, what's that? You got a million poison. Tough luck, kid. Too bad, so sad. Can't quite kill you, though. Angry, silent. Entrench. Interesting. Odd one, thanks for the prime sub. What's Harry Potter's favorite subject in school? Spelling. Burst in trench, quadruple your block. Kind of hilarious, really. I don't think we want that, but I like the concept. Hey, stop following me. And offering me poison stabs. I have enough of those. I wish I could buy the Art of War. I think this might actually be a rare case of I can afford to remove something, but I'm not going to. Even though arguably defend remove is still helpful. Because we do have another shop coming up in the future, probably. Unless I go this way instead. That's a lot of upgrades. I like that.
So I guess we don't do anything here. Uh oh, artifacts. I have no counters of this. Wait, yes I do. Black. Enlightenment. No, most of the deck is one cost. Don't think we take any of these. That's right, not resetting because the run looks fun. I, I figure that um, even if we can't master Clumsy, if it's uh, a run that's silly enough to be, for example, YouTube content, or silly enough to be personally entertaining to me, which is functionally the same thing, then uh, heck yeah, why not? Why not? Isn't playing funs the po ah, isn't having fun the point of playing the video game? And if absolutely obliterating snake plant on turn one is silent isn't fun, I don't know what is. I really like foresight here. Foresight can line up burst catalyst. Also a good seat target. Whetstone would upgrade Neutralize. That's it. Just Neutralize. Alright, well, don't take that. Good talk. And I guess I don't want to go to this shop. Could go to that shop for one less fire to get one more event later. Is it before the Elite? No, it's after an Elite. Okay, let's go to that shop. Sacrifice one upgrade here. Upgrade Seek, upgrade Catalyst. I don't have that much else to upgrade. Cal Campbell's a good one, I guess. I guess. Hmph. Not even killing the book on turn one. What the heck? What well, list made here? Sure. Just a little bit of help. This is probably fine. Take a little bit of damage. Raw Adrenaline Catalyst Catalyst. Perfect. We won't be needing this. Because it's bursting time. Ten poison? How about... 360 poison. GG. Get a meal ticket. That'll heal us at the shop. Perfect. This is going way too well. And build your own Runic Pyramid. Who the hell needs well laid plans when you can just burst equilibrium? Perfect. Upgrade this. <laughs> we can Strange Spoon to potentially keep those Catali. And the um, Calc Gamble, and the Seek, and the Adrenaline. Oh my god, the Seek? The Seek. Spoon, let's go. Can we concentrate anything? I don't think so. Noxious Fumes, too slow for us. We want Corpse Explosion, we want Bouncing Flask. Now we want Crippling Cloud with Paper Crane. I guess Fumes could break Artifact for us. I think it's still too slow. Are we sure we don't want a potion? We could also buy acrobatics. Not quite uh, dark shackles. Been a lot of shops, hey? I guess acrobatics is good. Funnel would have been nice. Guess we're not going to this. Yeah, we're not going to that shop. That's for sure. We just seek first deadly poison. We go deadly poison, burst, catalyst, catalyst. And that's 567 poison. Just for our own future reference. 
So that would kill literally any boss on turn one. I guess other than Donu Decker or whatever. Wallop Plus is interesting. Outmaneuver also interesting. Both randomly upgraded. We have no eggs. Crux 5, thanks for the Prime sub in the two months. We even have Wrath. How's it going, yellow, blue, green? I think 50-0 is a pretty cool accomplishment. Very tricky to do that. Let's skip these, I think. And these two. Conversely, how much is just burst deadly Keta? 126. Could even be energy generation with the uh, crescendo. Kind of funny. And we have Strange Spoon. You know what? I love it. I love it quite a lot. But I am going to upgrade acrobatics first. The Silent Stance Dance. Let's go. All right, Paper Crane, take us home. And here's the Seek. So we have we know it's 567, right? Although we don't actually have the energy for all of this. Give me Adrenaline Burst. This is not enough, I don't think. Not on one turn, anyway. Good enough. GG. Pretty good potion. Meteor Strike. Neat. There's also the man, Impervious here, can block for a lot, help us uh, hold on while the poison does its thing. But Meteor Strike is very interesting. We do have a orb slot, courtesy of the Prismatic Shard, so this immediately refunds four energy, if we can play it. And there's a couple ways for us to play it, actually, with the uh, Crescendo and Tranquility. And the Adrenaline, of course. I like it. I'm going to grab the Meteor Strike. I know that's a ridiculous thing to do, but we're going to do it. And there is a Cursed Key. Hold on a minute. What is this? We're going to get two chests of sacks, so we get two random curses. Odds are not in our favor, but... Things could happen. Things could certainly happen. Love a piercing whale. 
or something similar. This is our only shop. I guess this is a good opportunity to remove a card here. Footwork ain't terrible either, I guess. That's right, we do need enough money for dollies, I guess, so maybe we don't spend anything here. Yeah, let's let's wait. Let's wait. So let's acro. Hmm. Yeah, just foresight unload. Might as well tranquility then. This could actually be a tough fight for us. Can't just easily kill all these enemies at the same time. Sadly. So I'm not really sure why. Kept the adrenaline, I love it. Perfect. Sucker punch with paper crane is probably worth it. Paper crane could be a big way for us to survive here. Given that we may not be offered upgraded week again. We should probably just take it here. This is an interesting set of enemies. Take a bit here. That's okay. Not the worst thing in the world. Great. Interesting. That card is very potent with Burst. I'm going to give it a shot. Also kind of in awe of, of how many upgraded cards we've been offered on this run so far. Look at two here. Now nah, we're good. So, so burst turbo, always fun. Good way to get the meteor strike down, right? Speaking of, we are allowed to just seek meteor strike turn one. I 
gonna do that. Your strike adrenaline. A hundred damage. The power. Oh. -ho. No retain for us. I think I'll just play these. Good enough. Poison wise. And it's only 15 damage after all. Easy. Aska Pascale, thanks for the prime sub in the 14 months. Very much appreciated. Thank you, thank you. Alright, so we can seek for... Oh, I can seek for Burst Catalyst again. Hello. Would you like some more poison? Blurp. Bludgeon. Backflip's okay. I think I'll skip. Pain! Uh-oh. That's gonna hurt. And... Shame! Pain and shame, but also bottled seek. Seems good enough for me. Good trade overall, I'd say. Yeah, that's a pretty good trade. It's gonna be our turn one in a lot of fights now. A lot of fights. Not this one, though. I think this is probably still enough, though, yeah? Uh, no. No, it won't be. Let's do it this way, then. Even 38 by 3 is not enough. I guess we just take a big hit here. Ow. Fair enough. Good hit. Well done. Hmm. I'm okay without well-aid plans. I think. See, there's just going to be a shop immediately. That heals us and lets us remove... Are we sure we don't want a well-laid plans? I probably want a bouncing flask. And I guess we'll remove that pain. We'll keep it there. Sadistic nature's kind of fun, too. This guy just won't stop following us around. Truly ridiculous. Hmm. Try this.
vaguely acceptable. This will be a fun math exercise for chat. How scared are you right now? Oh, not anymore. Hee <laughs> hee. Blood. Doink. And... Boink. Alas, no clumsy curses befell us, but we had a ridiculous run. So, that's pretty cool. Two, three, four, five. Ah, uh, company. Foolish. And, oh hey, we can't kill these two at the same time. This might be a little bit more difficult. Hello? <laughs> random. What do you mean random? That's not how that's supposed to work. <laughs> Screw this guy in particular. What gives, man? That's great. Um, this will apply the weak now. How to aim the flask? It's a secret only streamers know. There's some hand space here. It's not a secret the Jedi would tell you. My face. But my face. Could have used the uh, poison potion there. Didn't feel like we needed to, though, since we've already killed one boss easily. Two thump, two thump, two thump. A deep, pulsing dread can be felt throughout the room. Is this the heart of the spire, the source of all this poison? Bear your stick. Poke that hard a bunch. Right in the aorta. 
Gonzo Archer, thank you so much for the incredibly generous 20 gifted subs. Holy moly. Welcome to the Cozy Sub Club, everybody. That's a huge showing of support. And as, again, given that we're now getting a 70-30 split on gifted subs, that's a, a huge amount of support for the channel, too. So I do really appreciate that. I'm essentially getting about 50% more money per subscriber than previously. It's a big deal. Since October 1st, when the Twitch Partner Plus program kicked in. That's a, a broad change at Twitch. So any, any channel that has more than 350 month-to-month -month subscribers... Uh, 350 partner plus points is how the Twitch determines it. Uh, any channel meeting that criteria gets a better split on most subscription types now. Which is pretty cool. That's partially due to competition from other streaming websites. Like uh, Kick, I believe, is part of the pressure here. Giving better splits to people who stream on there. I was already, of course, quite invested on Twitch really loved this website in particular, so getting rewarded for sticking around is pretty cool. I appreciate it, Will Wizard. We have mastered the hand drill. Don't think it would do a whole lot for us here. I'm thinking either Apotheosis or a good old Carter move. I think just the good old Carter move. Get rid of that shame. Katie Engel, thanks for the prime sub and the 14 months. As a Twitch partner, I do have an exclusivity for live streaming agreement. I'm not allowed to live stream on Twitch and another website simultaneously. So I can't, I cannot co-run a live YouTube stream. I cannot co-run a live kick stream without violating the terms of my agreement. And Anonymous, thank you for, so much for the very generous 10 gifted subs. So, no, I am not allowed to multi-stream. The folks love me. And I love them back. And the pie guy with the prime sub. Prime time. I think we'll keep this ghost. It's a good security blanket for the run. Okay. Oh, okay. So just seek... Burst Bouncing Flask, then. Only have five energy, so it's Burst Bouncing Flask, Catalyst, Catalyst. Seems like the right way to go. Could also do Bouncing Flask, Burst, Catalyst, Catalyst, but there might only be three poison to start. And even three time... Well, I guess it's times 81 if I Burst, Catalyst, Catalyst, right? So that's a guaranteed kill on someone. There's also the potion. Okay, well, Bouncing Flask first, then. I've determined. And if this happens, we might... We need more help. Okay, so you die turn one. That still means we take a bit of damage, and next turn could be pretty bad, actually. But we do have the Ghost in a Jar for that, if necessary. We also could have used the Poison Potion to kill this one. Guess we're losing the Ghost in a Jar. I don't love that. That is what we drew. So fair enough. Thinking maybe we should have used the Poison Potion, but... I also think we'll be just fine. Hopefully. Hmm, I could do a Crescendo Tranquility, play the Meteor Strike here. I think we want to do that. Doesn't 
doesn't seem like a smart move. I think this will be plenty of hit points. Especially with the poison starter. We might be able to apply 200 poison on turn one with the right draw here. Hmm, I don't think that's the right draw. Let's seek equilibrium and adrenaline. Did keep seek, that's good. And I think Predator Gamble. I just want to draw as deep into the deck as possible here. Good enough. It's definitely good enough. So all we have to do is survive one cycle of heart, essentially, and Paper Crane alone will do that with the Sucker Punch here. I think that's all we need. I really do. already dead in three, right? 165 times three? 495. No, we need more. We also need it to be weak next turn, unless we're killing. Looks like we got it. Crescendo strike for the win. And they said the crescendo wouldn't do anything. Strike, not enough damage. Deadly poison, blocked by artifact. But crescendo strike gets the kill. GG. GG. If you enjoyed that video, watch this one next. And don't forget to check out Baylor Lord Plays for variety content. Click the blue Baylor icon to subscribe.